pretty simple. The, the data showed uh, the wire still around and there's still over 7,000 in the last few months. So in that case, it's the, I know the government said, okay, everybody will get it, don't yeah. worry, and if you get vaccinated, you'll be fine. Uh, I'm kind of disagree because it's a very to case to case. So what do you think like people are refused to wear the mask? I just think that that is being a bit selfish and irresponsible. Uh, it's very understandable after two years of the situation, you want to go back to your normal life, your normal routine, and you feel really weird about, you know, I don't want to be locked in my house, I don't want to be in quarantines all the time. But I think we need to also take a step back and see, okay, what is actually going on and who is actually affected by these things. When you go on a bus or on trains, if everyone else is wearing a mask, do you feel some pressure to put the mask on too? I guess not anymore. When there was the restriction in place and then I wouldn't wear one, then definitely I would feel sort of judged that I'm not wearing one. But now that it's a free choice, then it's only up to me.